Hey, what up, shoot tube? This is Mo Butters back again on the Stone Cold Kicks channel, and we got another sick lit beater box battle for you today. We got two Soul Supremacy beater boxes here, and they're both kind of the same cost, but not exactly. One of them was $625, the other one was $725. So they're both kind of equal, but a $100 price difference. I'm gonna leave that up to you to decide who had the $100 higher price box. So remember, one was $625, one was $725. We're gonna go ahead and get right into this. As always, this is Mo Butters and Rock'em Sock'em Kicks. We're going ahead, getting it popping. These mystery boxes purchased from Soul Supremacy. Right, Soul Supremacy. I threw a shirt on that I got while I was out there, so I had to rep a little bit of Soul Supremacy in this video, man. We appreciate it. We got much love for Soul Supremacy. Yeah, we definitely do. So they always look out. It's our favorite sneaker, sneaker store. My favorite sneaker store in the world by far. Oh, yeah. They're not as flashy as some, but they hook it up way more than most. So appreciate that as always we are both beater box members that means we pay our monthly fee every month we get the chance to buy these boxes so we go ahead and do that whenever we get a chance i'm gonna go ahead and start it off with something my favorites and my guy right here likes a lot wore them on the channel these well, turfs these ago, Dion's, diamond turf, the, the diamond turf tools yeah those are dope man what size are those this looks like a little Good smaller condition. size yeah i like these uh, a lot it's that eight and a half What's crazy about these shoes, though, man, is if you ever check out the commercial, it's a crazy commercial. Like, it's a crazy referee. Um, you can YouTube it. And he, like, wraps the shoe. The shoe is wrapped in newspaper or something. It's like Christmas time. And he's like, geez, I wonder what it is. And then he's like a madman referee. And uh, this is Deion Sanders in the show. He's screaming. and It's just a crazy commercial if you get the chance to check it out. But, yeah, these are, these are hot, man. The Diamond Turf 2s, the yeah. red ones. So. After this video, might as well search it up. Right. Dion Turf 2 commercial Nike. Check it out. Yeah, y'all gonna be like, damn, this referee is crazy. <laughs> so this is them eight and a halfs. Lucy's no box, very good condition. Little little sign of dirt on the bottom. Probably worn just a few times. Alright, so uh, I don't have no loose pairs. No uh, Lucy's over got there. Got some Jordan Jordan 1 lasers to kick it off. Well feet. Six six and a half you 6.5 you so these are in good condition though they've been worn slightly you can see the clear sole uh changing just a touch but still icy. not icy though uh not much creasing still white and icy i always like laser shoes though i still like them still do but uh these are laser worn a lot of cool details in the laser and i think that at it. yeah and that swoosh is, is 3m 3m though. swoosh with the flick and like you always say you can you can customize these and do whatever you want with them. Yeah, that's a very work. nice base for a custom. I've had a few customs that are lasers, and you just throw like that red or that blue over that laser, and it just yeah, makes it, just it something else. Yeah, it's really it nice. Yeah, I like these though. Pretty cool, them laser ones. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Over here, we got some more Lucy's. Jordan 10. We're on the straight out of Lucyville. The Hornets. Yeah, these Jordan 10 from the City Pack, Charlotte Hornets, right. with the kind of pearlescent white. It's kind of hard to see, but if you look close, it has like a pearl fish scale type of flick on there. It's not just plain white, they're a little different. And these are the very good use condition. Mm -hmm. Maybe worn just one or two times. A little tiny dirt on the bottom, barely even creased on here. And the tans get creased pretty easily. Yeah, so, those are clean. Those yeah, these are, are like new, worn once maybe. What size are those? Mm -hmm. This is the Lucy. Look like a 13 or something. This is the size 12. 12? Pretty oh, okay. close, pretty close. Size 12 Lucy's, Jordan number 10s. Let me know if you need them. Got some more J's. Uh, Jordan ones again. That's cool. One of your favorite colors. Some of your favorite colors, mm -hmm. I should say. Some Barons. Barons. So these are pretty cool. They in good use condition. Um, I like the interior on these, and they come with a. Uh, I remember they do come with an extra set of laces too, though. Some gray laces come with them but the I, laces that's in there are cool i highly prefer those 3m laces i like yeah. the 3m ones a lot yeah me too I like the owner preferred them too never mm -hmm. pulled the gray ones out the bag right. the previous owner i should say so i'm the owner right now for the time being mm -hmm. but uh yeah these are pretty cool man i think i saw the six and i think it's a little feet that would look like a seven seven my bad seven youth so a couple of ones to kick off the, the box that's some heat all right this is part of the other pair Another pair of Lucy's, what we got here? Some Dunk Highs with the clear 
bottom with some sparkles integrated in there as well. These have a name I can't think of right now. It might yeah, be like sure the year name. of the something. or But it just got like a red suede. Very nice suede all on that. Nice yeah, swoosh. Buttery. Yeah, buttery, buttery suede on there. Yeah, yeah. That swoosh is leather with the gold accenting around it. Make it stand out pretty nice. And like I said, the bottom is clear. Still pretty clear, but these do look like they were worn maybe just a few times. Yeah. I see a couple pebbles on the bottom. So these are Lucy's No Box. The size is a size nine. Size nine SB Dunks. Let me know if you need these. All right, so I got another pair seven youth Jordan, uh, Jordan 13. So these are cool. Black and Black red. And, reds. and dirty breads. Yeah, so they're in good condition. Good leather on them and whatnot. Show y'all the bottoms. Um, pretty close to the playoffs. Races. Yeah, they are. It's just the the little white uh, pods on the side are uh, usually white, but they red on here. Kind of go with the shirt I got on. But these are these are cool. I remember when these came out. So size seven you. Let me seven know. Seven with dirty you breads. Keeping it rolling. Man, I'm still in Louisville over here. Still in Louisville. Let's see. Lucyville, right. coming right out of Loose these. Alley with some of these NMDs, black and red, with the little black ticks on there, all red mostly with the little black stripes. Yeah, those look cool. Yeah, these are pretty cool for some NMDs, and these yeah. are in very good use condition, been worn. That was a clear bottom, so it's a little discolored, but not really much wear other than that. This looks to be a size eight and a half. Lucy's, let me know if you need these. Keeping it rolling, some more Jordan uh, U, size five wide, infra, infrared, infra pink. Yeah. What I like to call them, but uh, these are pretty cool, man. Um, see the bottoms, you can never go wrong with with some sixes, man. I'm telling you, I still need my hands on them Gatorade sixes, pine green. <laughs> but yeah, these are size five uh, youth, and uh, barely rocked really. Looking Suede fresh. is still buttery. Soul, it's been they've been warm, but soul still icy. So let me know if any of you small feet heat me. It's that little five wide. I got, I got a bunch more boxes in here. Let's get to it. This looks like an older box. Jordan Jumpman. Steel tens. Black steel tens. This is the white with the gray and black. Called the steel tens. That's that steel type of gray. Mm -hmm. These are pretty good. These are one of the best tens to they me. Are, though. These sell for about one of the best prices for you know resale on tens. These are the good use condition. They've been worn but not smoked. A little wear on the bottom. A little bit of creasing on top. But still plenty of life left in there. This is that size eight, and this was the 2005 release of the steel tens. Mm -hmm. So you can let me know if you need this little size eight. Yeah, I see. That's that Jordan. That's that 2005 box. A lot of the J's came in with the with yep. the logo on the top. Mm -hmm. Around the Dub Zero time, the Jordan 20s time. All right. Um. I got some KD7. Oh, I got the on Pearl. Yep. These are pretty uh pretty popular uh pretty shoe. Exclusive for yeah. KD. Yeah, for KD. We've gotten a few of these in from time to time. All three of us pretty much but these are in good use condition clean them up a bit size seven so i've been getting a lot of the youth heat small feet heat in here but these are cool for some kds so let me know if you need them on um, pearls all right i got about five boxes all j's that's what it looks like in here that's what's up that's what's up this one right here got some alternate fours with the alternate lace swap in there yeah, it's the white and red laces. fours they came with the white lace. Somebody put the black lace in there. Got the jump man in the back. Pretty cool. Jump man flight tag on the tongue. It's pretty nice. These are all right. Pretty good overall condition. They look like they were never worn. Brand new, just lace swapped. I don't see any dirt on there. No creases on the top. All the stars on the, on the front. All stars, no signs of wear. So these are just brand new, just with the lace swap. Somebody flipped them laces and that didn't go hard enough for them. So they ain't rock them traded them in that's cool got this size eight for you let me know if you need it i got size 12. oh it's taking yeah. me but it's taking me back i ain't seen these in a while she man got 
These are the clear, uh, clear Air Force bodies. Ones, man. Man, I ain't seen these in years, man. These were actually popular back in the day, for real. Like, real talk, when they right. came out. They got the little premium, uh, little tag right here. I just, I haven't seen these in a while. What year are these from, man? I feel like I want to say 04 Originals. or something. Originals. Uh, 06. It's 2006. 06. So some... Okay. They look to be DS, though. Looking dead stock, yeah, I can it's tell. Just, just a little bit of discoloration because of, of the time, you know. That's what time does to these kicks. But the clear sole, man, I mean the clear Air Force One where you can see a sock in That's one of the only crazy. clear, like legit pairs. There was a lot of fake ones. It was, time. though. You're right. That's a legit clear pair. It was. Horses. That's crazy. It was a lot of fakes out there. They probably were so easy to make. Right. Yeah, this is a size. Size 12, let me check that the tag. That looks like a box. That's what I said, because it said wolf, yeah, wolf gray on it. That's the wrong This 11 and a half. Yeah, because the box said it was like a wolf gray shoe. That classic so, yeah, box size. So yeah, this is that, uh, that clear Air Force One where you can get those clears, pretty much see through. Get your dirty socks showing through right. those. Get your socks with whatever color socks you want. Or be dumb enough to go barefoot and look oh, like a man. clown. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> uh, I'm gonna put the one with the, with the tag on there. All man. right, you got that limited edition hang tag. I used to like those. Oh wow, man, man, that's why I had to laugh when I first popped them open. Funny, man. funny stuff. So we got another little old pair here. Some white flip threes. Just busting these out. These are looking very, very fresh. This looks to be a size oh, 11. Yeah. If this is the correct box. Yeah, size 11. And this was a 2006, probably late 2006, early 2007 release. I remember when them flips came out. Those was hot, man. Yeah, flips. Those flips, yeah. This was like a first of its kind type of thing with all oh, the wow. elephant prints meant all on top instead mm -hmm. of right here on the front. That's why it's called flips. Flip the elephant from here to up top. Right. It's one of the first ones that did something like this with know all that type of design all and over and it has a leather interior too leather premium inside too. very comfortable mm -hmm. it stands up to a lot of wears and stuff and doesn't show mm -hmm. no age there's no sock on there and stuff so it's pretty nice these are a little different these white flip threes it's that size 11 very nice condition overall let me know if you need these it's the heat from here so i got some ultra boost uh let's see Ultra. No, booster. He's looking DS, definitely DS. All whites, nice and fresh. The box is uh, exploding on. So the that back in. box. Right? As long as the shoes ain't doing the same. Mm -hmm. You feel me? But yeah, these are brand new. Got the tags and everything on them. Um, let me get that size. Ultra yeah. boosting. Oh, yeah. Size 12. So another size 12. That's going to be an easy one. sale. So I know it's a cool. lot of people looking for those. Right, boost and then all Dead white. Stock. You know, our white go with anything, pretty much. Fresh white. Yeah, they're going to interior, so. Nice weather's around the corner. You know it. Someone going to need those, for sure. So, that's what I got for that one. Nice, nice stuff. Let's see. Looks like a Jordan 1 box. What kind of Jordan 1s are in here? What we got? Some of these, not a favorite in my book, but they're all right. All black Jordan with the gum bottom. And these are looking to be dead stock at least, so these are going for sale pretty easy. Don't even have to clean them, just take them picks. How you feel about these? Oh, they're straight, man. They're straight. Black with the gum bottom, pretty Those simple. brand new? Yeah, they're brand new dead stock. Yeah, they're brand new. Never worn, size 12. Can let me know if you need these, Jordan ones. They're black with that gum bottom, it's cool. All right, so I'm back to the kid size. It's looking like some Jordan 3, uh, Infrared. Infrared. She's barely rock. Not even no creasing. Pull them both out. Yeah, these are these are, Those are barely nice. rock. These are nice, man. And check like the, the bottoms. They're out. a lot like the white cement threes, but the little yeah. infrared additions on there. Yeah, as you can see on the on the side where the holes are at, and then at the bottom, they got their little accents of that infra. Infrared. Yeah. Those are real nice on feet. I like those. Yeah. So that's a that's a seven U. I got two more pairs over here. Let's see what's going on. George, jump man, jumping out the box. I won't even check the sticker the box tag. I'll just pull them out. Some black infrared Jordan 11 lows in a good use condition. A little wear and discoloration on the bottom. Pretty good on top. And what's the color? Uh, the size is size 12. Some infrared low 11s, pretty nice. Let me know if you need these, size 12. All right, I'm about to uh, rip oh. off a couple of, because I still got three more boxes. Three more. So I'm gonna just rip off a 
a few more. So I got some size 11 uh, Adidas. These looking, I don't know, they've been rocking a little bit. EQT supports. So pretty nice. Cool little colorway. I've been getting a lot of this infrared got type the infra of pink on yeah, there. Yeah, and this whole this whole box been a lot of infra infrared or infra pink. So these are pretty uh decent size. I think that's what it is. It's size 11. Um, size good 11 use EQTs. condition. So I'm gonna list those soon. And you can cop. You know, somebody gonna need those. Yeah. So you gotta bust another one out over there. All right. We got receipt with receipt. Oh, receipt. Uh, Where are you taking it? Let me see. Let's see. I'm gonna save another box I got enough to last. Ooh. Got some KDs. Some of those. I've never These seen that colorway. Well. Getting the same colorway. These are decent though, actually. I've never seen it either. So what is this? This is another U6.5 six six U. My bad. Um, I actually never saw this colorway before either. Um, but th these look straight, actually. There's not a lot of wh all majority white KDs. Yeah, Those that's true. Yeah. They usually they got colorful, crazy yeah. colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So with them being majority white and then gold and then black laces, these are cool. So, um, we got those. So you saving that box for last over there? Yeah, I guess I'll see what, what it's talking about. Alright, so this Let's is see. my last one on this side. Let's see what it is. It looks like a big size. size 12. And this some Jordan 5. Fire red with the black tongue. Black tongue mm -hmm. with the jump man. Fire red on the bottom. Black with the 2-3. These are the very good use condition. I could see some wear on them. Slight creasing. A little bit of dirt on the bottom. But very good overall. Big size 12, join number five, fire red. Let me know if you need these. Yes, sir. Uh, got my whole side filled. I know, man. My hand is full with, I got all these. Switch those in, okay. Of so the only reason why I said I saved it for last, I saw the Supreme uh, logo on the side. So we'll, see. we'll see what's in here, though. What is it? Okay. It's Vans, but. Okay. What you know about That's these? That's the blood and semen. <laughs> That's what they're called. Straight up. The blood and semen, and that's the Vans Chucker. Yeah. Yeah. These are brand new DS. Those came out this year around in the summertime. Yeah. They're pretty hot. They they got a lot of people liking those um yeah. blood and semen. They say they could put anything on a on whatever, sure. you know, shoes, clothing and that's crazy. And that that is it. what's on here too. <laughs> that's blood and semen swirled around. Which I see that. And people cop it. Yeah, when you look at it. They copping. What size are they? I don't think it's a size on the box, so I'm gonna have to look on it. Looks like a normal size. Yeah. Size ten and a half, that popular size ten and a half. So blood and semen. That's them. Man, Supreme. Going for sale soon. You know the routine. Yep. Yep. Supreme heads, that's the type of stuff y'all like. Off the wall it says on the back. And then go to bottoms. Brand new. Legit, good to go. That was gonna be an easy sale. Sounds good. Throw them yep. up top. <laughs> <laughs> So, thanks as always for joining us to do this beater box battle on the Stone Cold Kicks channel. We'll go ahead and slide right into the on feed heat yeah. portion. It's something I've showed quite a few times, but this is what I'm rocking in the windy city streets right now. And it's a cold winter, and these are taking a pound, and so I'm gonna just keep rocking these all week long. So that's what I got. Right, makes Threads. sense. Um, as I told y'all before, I'm a fan of Kobe, Kobe ones and fours. So these are the Kobe ones. These are the uh, Minneapolis Laker edition Kobe ones. So these are the uh, these are his first actually his first uh, Nike shoe he had once he had with the Lamb. But actually the Hirachi 2K4s and 2K5s was supposed to be his first and second shoe, but he caught that rape case. <laughs> so this is his first one. But if you look at the interior, some numbers in there, and uh, I guess they some old school uh, Minneapolis Lakers numbers. I don't know the players or nothing like that. Uh, and if you didn't know, that's where the Lakers uh, name came from. The original yeah, Lakers. Right, the original yeah, Lakers. Lands of a thousand lakes. So that's why this is a Minneapolis Lakers. And I know y'all have seen the, the uh, uniforms they wear sometimes. That's and on the inside, colorway. I love this colorway too. On the inside, it has that Minneapolis tag on there. And it has it on the, the toe too. I mean, the uh, little, little lace loop. But I like these, man. Then they got the little chrome uh, tips on here. That colorway kind of reminds me of like a Back to the Future Air Mag type of colorway. That yeah, it does gray. though. It's got that buttery suede. My, one of my favorite parts of the Kobe ones is the, these teeth right here. That's on here. I like that. I like that. And then the little top part. It kind of reminds me of like Jordan 14's had that little, 
you know, piece on the, yeah, on the carbon front. fiber all in the back. Carbon fiber all the way yeah, around. That's pretty cool. So the Kobe ones are popular Kobe, you know, and then it has up tempo. One of the red shoes that have up tempo on the back. You usually see those on Pippins or something with an air bubble. These don't have no air bubble, you know. So these are one of my favorites, man. Like I say, the ones and the fours. So I had to rock them on the channel Kobe. with the Soul Supremacy T-shirt. <laughs> yeah, good looking out, Soul Supremacy. That's who's uh, bringing most of these boxes to us and bringing this content to you. So thanks for tuning in for that. As always, this is Mo Butters and Rock'em Stock'em Kicks on the Stone Cold Kicks channel. Thanks for tuning in. Two at a time, all the time. Till next time.